Understanding. No news is good news. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English phrase. No news is good news. This expression might seem a bit puzzling at first glance, but don't worry. We're here to unravel its meaning and usage for you. So, let's get started and explore why sometimes not hearing any news can actually be a good thing. The phrase, no news is good news, is a classic example of English idiomatic expression. It suggests that if you have not received any new information or updates about a situation, it is likely that nothing wrong has occurred. This expression is often used in contexts where the absence of news is seen as a sign that things are stable or unchanged, particularly when there is a potential for bad news. While the exact origin of no news is good news is a bit murky, it's believed to have been around for centuries. This phrase reflects a common human tendency to worry about the unknown or potential problems. Historically, in times without instant communication, receiving no news was often better than getting bad news. This sentiment has persisted through time, encapsulating the relief felt when silence indicates that everything is probably fine. To help you understand how to use no news is good news in everyday situations. Let's look at some examples. Parent to another parent, have you heard anything from the school about the trip? I hope everything's okay. No, but remember, no news is good news. They would call us if anything were wrong. In a professional setting, we haven't received feedback on our project proposal yet. It's been a while, but no news is good news. Let's stay positive. These examples show that the phrase is versatile and can be used in various contexts to reassure someone or to express hope that the lack of updates is a positive sign. Thank you for joining us to explore the meaning behind, no news is good news. We hope this video has shed light on this intriguing expression and how it can be applied in different scenarios. Remember. English is full of idioms and phrases that enrich our communication, and understanding them is key to mastering the language. Until next time, keep learning, and don't worry too much if you haven't heard any news lately, it's probably a good sign.